Today's exciting episode begins about a foot and a half to the left of yesterday's exciting episode at American Eagle Squadron Headquarters. Hey, gang, I got a letter here with no stamp on it. Who do I know owns a post office? Why don't you open it? Good thinking, Dee. Hey, it says your friends and neighbors have selected you to come to the aid of your country. Report immediately to your Army Draft Board. Do not pass go. I've been drafted into the Army. I'm too young. There must be some mistake. Of course you're too young. Let's ask Roger. We can't. He's on his way to Lompoc to the chiropractor's annual convention. They want him to throw out the first back. Doodle, you'll just have to go down there and explain to the draft board. But that proved easier said than done. The sergeant said, You got papers from the government and then you're drafted. And Doodle said, But I'm too young and I don't see so good. And the sergeant said, We'll give you false whiskers and put you right up front and you won't miss a thing. And Doodle said, I won't like it. And the sergeant said, You can have all the chow you want to eat. And Doodle said, Where do I sign? And so young Doodle was inducted into the army even though he was too young. It appeared that the army had made one of its first mistakes since Valley Forge. Doodle was immediately put into a basic training unit with many other recruits. All right, you recruits, we're going to learn you how to soldier good or anything. First off, I want you to learn to run through an obstacle course. Now run! <laughs> Get out there and... And the daily inspections were no better for poor Doodle. Where's the man who belongs to this equipment? Down here, your worship. You're very, very short. And fat. Now, can I get out of this chicken outfit? But it seemed Doodle was destined to be a private in that man's army unless something could be done to show the government that they made a mistake and drafted a boy. Roger, how are we going to get Doodle out of the army? Jack, my boy, they love me in Lompoc. But what about Doodle? Oh, yes. Well... I'll fly to that army camp right away and explain to the general. I'm sure he'll understand. And Roger did just that. And the general did understand. But he said, Unfortunately, Ramjet, there's nothing we can do about it right now. Our camp is having war games. All of the men are out on maneuvers. Do you mean you're pretending there's a war and fighting among yourselves? That's it. We divided the men into two groups, the Red Army and the Blue Army. They're fighting right now with blank ammunition. Here's one for Wallace Berry. I got you. I got you first. You did not. I got you first. Boy, you really make me mad, Fred. Oh, yeah? Take yeah. that. Do oh, oh, sting, burn. You mean we can't get Doodle out of the army until these war games are over? I'm afraid not, Ramjet. It's... Hark. What's that sound of marching feet, General? It's the sound of marching feet, Ramjet. And look. Captured guy, stop. I'm in halt. Private Doodle's reporting, sir. Why aren't you men out playing war games? I captured them, General. They're all my prisoners. Good lad, Doodle. But your prisoners are from both the Red and the Blue Armies. You know I'm colorblind, Roger. Nice work, my boy. I'm going to give you a medal. Couldn't I just have a cheeseburger instead? All right, but you're going to look pretty messy with a cheeseburger pinned to your chest. Private Doodles, we salute you. Goodbye and good... <laughs> So ends another fun-filled, action-packed, gas-operated, clip-fed, semi-automatic, air-cooled episode of Roger Ramjet and the American Eagles! When Ramjet takes a proton pill, the crooks begin to worry. They can't escape their awful fate from protons, mighty fury. Roger Ramjet, he's our man, hero of our nation.
reason for his adventures. Just be sure and stay tuned to the station. So come and join us, all you kids, for lots of fun and laughter. As Roger Ramjet and his men get all the crooks they're after. Roger Ramjet, he's our man, hero of our nation. For his adventures, just be sure and stay tuned to the station.